Let's use the letter F to represent frequency, which is the number of cycles per second. The Greek symbol lambda is commonly used to denote the wavelength, which is the distance between any two successive identical points on the wave. You should know that after one full cycle, you've gone through one full wavelength. Look what you get when you multiply a wave's frequency by its wavelength. Follow the units. You've got one per second times a unit of distance, such as meters. That gives meters per second. Sound familiar? Yep. Those are the units for speed. What you're getting here is the speed of the wave, which is how fast it moves. So we find the speed of a wave equals its frequency times its wavelength. Let's say a bird sees a delicious crab crawling up and down a post in time with the passing waves. The crab is going up and down once every two seconds. If the wavelength is, say, three meters, how fast are the waves traveling past the post? The wave speed is frequency times wavelength. So that's one cycle per two seconds times three meters equals 1.5 meters per second. This relationship of frequency times wavelength equals wave speed holds true for all kinds of waves, water waves, sound waves, light waves, you name it. What's fascinating is that if you have a higher frequency, that necessarily means a shorter wavelength, and a lower frequency necessarily means a longer wavelength. Frequency and wavelength are inversely proportional to each other. You can't make one bigger without the other getting smaller. But notice that the product of the two remains the same. That is, the wave speed remains constant no matter what the frequency or wavelength. So what determines the wave speed? Well, you know how it's easier to wade through a pool of water than through an equally deep pool of maple syrup? That's right. It's the medium through which you are traveling that determines how fast you can travel. The same holds true for waves. How fast waves travel depends upon, and only upon, the medium through which the waves are traveling. Good energy. Good energy.